Savage X Fenty is now getting into the workout collection. Interesting. I've got a whole haul. I've got the entire collection and we're gonna try it out. I work out five to six times a week, so I really want workout clothes that is gonna be supportive, that I'm able to move, that it's not restrictive. I usually work out in shorts, but if I'm on the trail or doing a lot of outside work, I wear long pants. So I'm gonna get into this. All the clothes is from the new line. Everything's in a medium except for one pair of pants, and I will say which pants is a different size because they didn't have any medium. I'm medium in everything Savage X, so I just buy the same size I am a 32 triple D just for size references but I can wear 34 double D I usually wear mediums in most workout gear okay so this is the hotline bling hotline set this is a medium impact bra I like the back I think the back is cute but this is still impractical maybe you can wear this to Pilates but when I put these pants on I felt like one of the Wayne brothers in White Chicks. Like I, it, it stopped here. It's not comfortable. The bra is a little tight. Um, as you can see, the back is cool, but I don't like the, this part right here, I can't think of what it's called. I don't like that. Coupled with how the back is, the bra itself is supportive and it looks good on, but I feel constricted. I feel like a little, a hot dog or meat inside a casing. It's there. Maybe if you get a size up, it'll fit better. Like it won't be as tight. The the more I'm wearing it, the more comfortable it's feeling. But as far as working out, I wouldn't work out in this. Maybe light, something really light. I couldn't cycle in this. One could do yoga and this, uh, I guess, something low impact because I will say it does stretch and I feel like I'm coming back. I don't know. I just, this feels very superhero and I don't, I don't like how I'm feeling constricted. Like I just, I don't feel free and then the top is, is tight. So if you like the hotline bling, like I said, the back is really cute. I would size up in both of this, but low impact. I don't see how you're doing any high intensity. It's tight on my calves. I honestly want to just take this off okay so these are the pinup high-waisted leggings <laughs> These are so cute. These are these are a large and they fit way better than the other ones. This part right here is a tad bit big. I think the medium it would be a little bit tighter, but they were able to get on better. So maybe if you have thick legs, I suggest sizing up. I'll see going throughout the whole list to see if you fully have to size up. But right now, this is a large. The last pair was a medium. The large fits better. This is so cute. But what gym are you going in with this? I get that she wanted to be sexy, but imagine showing up to Pilates in this. Imagine showing up to LA Fitness anytime, 24 hour fitness, any gym, insert there. And this, like people are gonna look at you crazy. I don't think I would work out in this. I wouldn't even take myself serious in yoga in this. This is super cute. I just don't know where you're gonna go in this. Like, even if you're going to the grocery store, people are gonna think you're a dominatrix. <laughs> this is a joke. But it looks good. Practicality in these, zero. Looks wise, <sighs> she did her thing. Practicality, no. I love Rihanna to death, but at this point, I don't believe she works out. I don't even think Kim Kardashian would wear something like this to work out in. You know what this is good for? This is good for if you're a dancer going to rehearsal, I get this. That This is who this is for. This is for dancers. Anybody else? No, you're not stepping into your Pilates, yoga, um, spin class in this. But you are if you're a dancer and you're going to the studio. That's who this is for. This set right here is for dancers. Nobody else. Okay, so this is the Curve Alert and size medium. So far, this has been the most comfortable set top wise and I kind of like this. So I think I would keep this. The bottoms, I hate. This part right here, I think it's supposed to show that you have a, you know, a bigger butt than usual. So I'm trying to give like more curve, but it's uncomfortable. Like this line here, I don't need this line here to work out. I like the first pair, the black set, the first, first black set, even though I felt like I was in a sausage caving, it stretched more than this. 
to go up a size. I'm not sure if that would change this ribbing aspect of it, but the bra is comfortable. This is the most comfortable sports bra that I've tried on so far, but it doesn't have that much protection, so mm. But this is really good for low impact. I think out of everything, I might keep this top because I do like how it feels. I hate that it was in blue. With this set, this might be a popular set. They, this is the only color that they had left. So that's why I'm mm, kind of annoyed. If this was in black, definitely. This Royal Icy Blue, eh, I don't know. I ain't feeling it. But comment below what's your favorite look so far. Give me your thoughts on the pieces. I mean, I know which one looked the best, which was the last one, but practicality. None of these have been practical so far. All right, this one is called the lineup pants. The most comfortable pants. I'm not even gonna lie, these pants feel great. The only thing I don't like is that I feel as if like if you're working out, the waist might kind of fall down. But other than that, these pants is what I thought the line would be like. I thought it would be more workout friendly for working out in different types, no matter what you're trying to do, if you're trying to be active because you said sport. The top I don't like. This is the matching top with the I feel like like you can size up for the top. It's a little tight, and so I guess the tightness. Okay, I think the tightness is supposed to add a layer of protection because they didn't fall out of place. It's tight here. It's a medium, so I think if you are someone who is bigger around here. I think you should size it. Like I said, I'm a 32. This is a medium and it's a little it's a little small on me. But the pants are good. They also have pockets. And the material is better. This is the material you would see in sports collections. Victoria's Secret Sports line uses this kind of material, but you're more active, active like Nike, Adidas. They don't typically use this type of material that's in this pants. And I'll look it up the material, just like put it down below what kind of material it is. Feels like maybe a polyester blend. Fun fact, I worked at Nike for like six, seven years. So I really know a lot about the technology that they use. They're all about making sure that it's dry fit, that it, it that the sweat, you know, releases and all that. So they're really particular what they use. This is what you would see in more of yoga brands like a Lululemon or the other brands. They kind of use this material, which I'm not against if you're doing low intensity workouts, but if you're doing high intensity workouts, I don't care for this material. But this is cute. I like the color. I didn't think I would like the color, but the color looks really great on my skin. I need these pants and the other bra top. So if I can just put that top on, put these pants and it'd be the same color, preferably in black, it'd be a winner. Okay, this is the mesh medium impact bra set. This is the most comfortable bra, I think, out of the entire collection that I've tried on. I like this one better than the blue one just because it has more support. The mesh makes it feel very breathable. I don't really care for the color. The pants are okay. I don't think they're the best to work out in, but if you're doing something low intensity, yes. And if you still want that sleek and cute, sexy look, but want something more practical. I would go with this set over the ones in the beginning. They weren't as practical. I mean, like I said, unless you're a dancer, I don't see where else you're gonna wear that. But this one gives the illusion of the, the one with the mesh, but you're covered. So if you still like that silhouette of like I've got a garter belt on and it gives the illusion that you have more curve, I would go with this one over the last one. But y'all let me know in the comments, cause baby, this is what the back looks like. I don't care for the material when you pull it over it's got this elastic and i think that's to help for it to not fall off but it's not that comfortable but i see now that i'm wearing it it's not riding it's not slipping down so i get what's there i just don't like it but yeah, 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 you can move You can move in this one. So a combination between sexy and practical is this set. Is it doing what it needs to do? No, but if you want both and you're someone who's doing low intensity workout, you're not doing anything major, this would work. Um, you can wear this to Pilates, you can wear this to yoga. You could wear this to the gym if you're doing, you know, something low. The sports bra is great. There, there's no complaints but sports bra. I just think that this is kind of restricted. So like if you're below I feel like you wouldn't feel comfortable. You wouldn't feel sexy in it. I think this is these bottoms are more geared to someone who's smaller, but to each his own. I don't like it when I have clothes and it kind of like folds over and it makes me look a little like it makes my top look bigger than what it is. You know, that's just my personal preference. <sighs> my final 
final thoughts on the line I, I don't like it not for working out if she was saying that this was just for <sighs> I don't know the the fact that she used the word sports it doesn't equate to sports this is more dance this is more yoga this is more pilates but sports i don't see you going to the gym getting a real good workout in, doing a hit workout going to orange theory doing a cycling class i just don't see how you can do that in those clothes the burgundy set you could work out in the black and pink set you could work out in and even the blue set if you're okay with that extra boning on your booty you could work it in that the sports bras and all three of those was really good they had great support i mean the blue one i wouldn't run in the blue one or the burgundy one because i didn't think it was enough enough support like if you're doing you know low-ish medium intensity workouts i think it's fine anything out that that i'm actually have to move move up and down i'm jumping that it's not working and i think some of the clothes are too sexual i love sexy stuff all day but i also don't like being a distraction in the gym it's bad enough that my body is a distraction i don't need mesh tights that looks like I'm wearing a garter belt in the gym and I think that's where there's a little disconnect from it. I want sports gear to be practical and be sexy and I think the people who do it best for practical and sex appeal would be Victoria's Secret even though I don't shop there as much but they do a real good job of making sure it's practical and that it's still sexy like this is a Victoria's Secret yoga bra and as you can see it's practical but it's still sexy um it feels great this is actually one of my favorite bras from them she had a good attempt I think maybe if she would have partnered with real athletes with creating this line I think it would have been better I don't know who was collaborating with this but they need to go back to the drawing books if you like this video like comment let me know what you think let me know what your favorite outfit was let me know your critiques everything's down in the description so you can check it out some of the stuff it might be sold out because I had a hard time getting certain colors thank you so much for watching the video I hope you enjoyed it comment down below what your favorite part was I do have some videos on the screen that I think that you would enjoy now we're trying to get in shape new year new you let's do better this year and until next time